So I pulled this thing out of, oh, you know where. Um, and uh, I'm just thinking I would just harvest the batteries out of it. 16,000 milliamp hours, five volts, two, two amps. So it's a, it can take up a two amp input and it can pump out three amps or nine volt, well, because it's USB-C, USB type C, so it can also put out nine volts at two amps and 12 volts at one and a half amps. There's, I figured there's probably lots of battery in there, but um, when I took a look at it and opened it up, this was the failure that somebody had thrown it away for. So this was the failure. The USB-A connector had cold solder joints along here and basically just got pressed out after the solder joints failed. So I think all I have to do is solder those guys back in and then this also got bent off and uh, we'll have a working uh, battery. So, yeah. Um, Gigastone, fail. Okay, so there it is with proper s solder joints on it. Now, I can't really get a good inspect on the USB-C connector. But um, it should be under less mechanical stress unless I really muck things up. But I would expect the same sort of problems to occur. I might try and do a bit of drag solder in there, but not right off the top of the bat. So while we're in here, what is powering this guy? And IP D three eighteen. So yeah, there we go. It's charging up, and now can I get power out of it? Is the question. Yeah, it's even fast charging. Nice. So it actually can deliver the uh, two amps that it claims. All right.